Hello friends, welcome to Technique. This is Normal here. And in this video, we're going to do the gaming performance tests of the new Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. So Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra is the latest flagship device from Samsung. And uh, this uh, comes with uh, the Exynos 2100 octa-core processor. In India and Europe, this is running on the Exynos chipset, while in US, it is the Snapdragon 888 octa-core processor. Now, the Exynos 2100, uh, coupled with 12 gigs of RAM and 256 GB storage, is our variant. And uh, this also has uh, a Quad HD uh, AMOLED display. This is a dynamic uh, AMOLED display with 120 Hz refresh rate that's being offered here. Now, this is again a 5 nanometer chipset, the Exynos 2100. And let's see how good uh, it plays. It has Android 11, the One UI 3.0, and uh, a good uh, display overall. The battery capacity is again at 5000 mAh. So, in this video, we'll be playing three games as Fall 9, uh, Dead Trigger 2, and COD Mobile to see uh, how good the experience is. We'll also see if this device heats up because uh, Exynos have this uh, issue of uh, heating up while gaming. So, is it uh, still happening on the Exynos 2100? That's what we are going to talk about in this video. So, if this is your first time on this channel, do hit that red subscribe button and also hit the bell icon to get notified of all the videos we publish. So let's get started with the gaming of the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. So we have the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra with us and uh, we're going to do the gaming test. So before going to the gaming test, let's first have a look at the temperature of this device. So uh, you can uh, see that now it's like uh, 36 degrees. So you can uh, right now see 35 degrees uh, on the back panel. Uh, there you go, 35 degrees on the back panel. And uh, on the display, it's uh, around uh, 35.9. So that's the temperature. So there you go. Uh, around 35, 36 degrees on the display as well as the back panel. That's the temperature right now. So you can uh, clearly see it's around 35.6. Now the battery is around 62 percentage. So you can see here 62 percentage is the battery. So now let's uh, start the gaming. So around 35 degrees and uh, 62 percentage. So let's first start with Asphalt 9.
So now we are done with asphalt uh, 9. Let's see the temperature. So you can see here it has gone to 41.6 already uh, with asphalt 9. You can see that the, near the camera you can uh, see 41.6. Even the back also you could see 41. So it uh, definitely rises uh, very fast and the display is uh, slightly lesser at around 39.2. But still, uh, the back panel has reached already reached 41.6. Now, let's uh, uh, next game would be a uh, dead trigger 2. Let's uh, play for some time and then finally we'll play asphalt. I mean, in fact, uh, COD mobile. So, asphalt 9 was a pretty smooth experience overall. Uh, no lags uh, we could see, and uh, even overall experience uh, was uh, quite good. So, that's asphalt 9. So after dead trigger 2, let's see the temperature. So it has already gone up to uh, 43 degrees. You can see here 43.2. So that's the temperature. You can uh, right now see 43.6 even. So it's definitely going higher. Uh, 43.2 on uh, the back panel. So you can uh, see that's the temperature 43.2. And uh, the display is uh, around uh, 40 degrees so slightly above 40 degrees so uh, the heat is definitely uh, increasing over a period of time so next uh, game would be uh, COD mobile let's uh, play COD mobile and see how good the gaming experience is So now we are done with uh, COD mobile and you can see that it goes up to 44 degrees. 
so there is definitely uh, increase so it's still below 45 degrees so no overheating but definitely uh, on the higher side so you could see that uh, it's still on the higher side 44 degrees uh, is what we are getting on the back panel so there you go you can see here 43 44 degrees and the display is again uh, 42 uh, 42.1 so that's not a major concern so 44 is the maximum uh, temperature we got on the back panel so this is definitely better performance than the exynos uh, last year's exynos uh, chipset uh, this is uh, 2100 which performs uh, much better than that now uh, overall in terms of battery uh, drain you can see that from 62 percentage it has come down to uh, 51 percentage so that means 11 percentage drop in around 35 to 35 minutes of gaming in fact 35 minutes and uh, the battery drain is around 11 percentage so that is the gaming performances heating and battery drain of uh, the samsung galaxy s21 ultra hope you enjoyed watching this video do hit that like button and also hit the red subscribe button for more videos thanks for watching hope to see you in our next video have a great day